Is Classic Sonic really Sonic's younger self? Do the humans and Mobians live in the same world? Is there more than one Green Hill Zone? Streak and welcome to the Theory First, where we take discuss theories relating to video games, movies, TV shows, comic books, and anything geek related. For those of you who have been following my channel, you may have seen my own theories about the Sonic franchise, and you seem to enjoy them. Ever since the first Sonic game, everyone has been wondering about the world building in the Sonic franchise. For example, is Sonic's world called Mobius or Earth? And when Sonic Forces came out, people have been asking more interesting questions about it. Like, is Classic Sonic actually from another dimension, or is or from the past? And what happened to all the humans when Eggman took over? Well, with the Sonic movie coming out very soon, I'll do my best to answer these questions in three parts. With part one asking if there's more than one Green Hill Zone, Part 2 dealing if humans and Mobians live on the same planet, and Part 3 if Classic Sonic and Modern Sonic are the same Sonics or two different Sonics. So without further ado, let's go at the speed of sound and see if we can make sense of the world building of Sonic the Hedgehog. To start off, let's talk about the Green Hill Zone. For those of you who have known, the Green Hill Zone is a lush paradise with palm trees, flowers, totem poles, waterfalls, and checkered soil located on South Island, and it's the first and most well-known zone or stage in Sonic the Hedgehog. Not only that, but it was featured in most Sonic games. But the question is, is there more than one area named Green Hill? Now before I continue, I know there are zones which look similar to Green Hill Zone including Emerald Hill, Seaside Hill, Emerald Town, Splash Hill Zone, Sunset Hill, and Windy Hill Zone. But these are separate and not what we were looking for in this theory. We are looking to see if there are areas which have the same name or a similar name as Green Hill Zone. Now what's interesting is that this is a possibility because Many cities around our world have the same name as Green Hill in one form or another. For example, there's one in Alabama, Indiana, Tennessee, Lancashire, England, and even in Poland. If this is possible in our world, the same thing could probably happen in Sonic's world. So if there is one Green Hill Zone in South Island, what about the others? Well, in Sonic Blast, there is a Green Hill Zone but from the looks of it, it's not the same one from South Island. This right here could be an example of a zone also named Green Hill Zone in Sonic's world. Another interesting example is Mecha Green Hill Zone from Sonic Chaos. Well, what about the description of it taking place on South Island? Well, I could discover that, like Green Hill, there's more than one island called South Island, including one near Australia and one part of the Faroe Islands near France. A similar example is Neo Green Hill Zone from Sonic Advance, which in the beginning has a beach with the second act having a bridge. But now, another question is, what about Green Hill in Sonic Forces? Well, from the world map, the location for this Green Hill seems to be more inland than the Green Hill Zone from South Island. And it seems similar to South Island, but thanks to Eggman invading it and drying up the water, it is left dry, sandy, and desolate with one of Eggman's pyramid bases built within it. So from this, I conclude that Sonic's world has more of a similarity to our world, with many places having the same name in different locations with a different look. And the same thing can be said about Chemical Plant Zone, Metropolis Zone, and the difference between Station Square from Sonic Adventure and Station Square in Blue Ridge Zone. I don't, still don't know if this is still canon or not. With this in mind, this concludes part one of my Sonic Theory series. In the next episode, we'll look to see if humans and Mobians live on the same planet, or separate planets. So that concludes my theory for if there's more than one Green Hill Zone in Sonic's world. I mean, what do you guys think? Do you think there is more than one Green Hill Zone, or an area named Green Hill Zone? What are your thoughts about it? And 
do you think this actually may well, be possible? Well, let me know in the comment section down below. So that's all the time I have today for this video, but don't worry, we have plenty of theories to look for some more soon. So stay tuned for more. So thank you very much for watching. If you like this video, don't forget to super smash that like button. Leave a comment down below to see what you think about this video, and don't forget to share a friend if you want to. And be sure to subscribe and click that notification bell to get day for the latest content. So once again, thank you very much for watching, and I will see you next time. Peace, out.